Hi everyone. Today I'm I'm going to show you how to install how to download and install MySQL server by using MySQL installer. Okay, let's get started. Uh first first of all you need to you need to download MySQL installer from G Internet. Okay, you can search in, search on Google my SQL installer. Okay, here. Yeah. So, uh, the first result of on Google, you click on the first result here. Yeah. Here, here are our MySQL community download. You select a uh, job operating system. I'm using Microsoft Windows. Here, click on here to download my uh, install. Okay, click download. Uh, if you do, if you don't want to create Oracle account, you click on no thanks just start my download here you say fine okay the download is stuck in here so waiting for download successful here um after download successful you open the download folder and you you will see a file with the install installer file. So click on the installer. Accept for run. Yeah. Uh, before you uh, select developer, okay. Click next. Click next. Uh, you you didn't need to inst install this package, so press next. Okay. Yes. Here are little um package you will be in uh will be installed so click Q to install this back packet okay click execute Here we are. After a few minutes, we have completely installed on this packet. So click next. Now you have to you have to configure config config um, server info uh, server information. So click next. Here we have to. Stand alone. This is um, this information. Uh, you should be live uh, by the default. Uh, 
you didn't, uh, you shouldn't change this information. Okay. Uh, with authentication method, we have to we have to uh, option here a strong password and legacy authentication method. Uh, you should be choose uh, method. Okay, click next. In uh, on this step, you have to um, provide password for root account. Uh, first type of you uh, type the password once, and the second type of you have to repeat that password again. local hard only this uh, PC this uh, machine can accept uh, the, uh, the database but with all on hard you can uh, connect your MacPL server from the other, other um, machine okay uh, row you have a multiple row here and you should uh, choose one or to one you you want okay uh provide uh, provide password for this user okay if you want to edit user select on click edit or you want to delete uh, select a user and click delete okay next here we are uh, uh if you want to run, uh, you should be uh, stand system account for run Windows service. Uh, um, should be it, it should be if you are not a administration, uh, so you should be live at default. Okay. Uh, here are the option for you. If you don't want to MySQL server start at stop, you uncheck here. Okay, I'm on check. Okay, next. Uh, click. Uh, you should be click execute to finish your install 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 installation. Okay, execute. Okay, click 
uh, finish to complete. Okay. Next. Finish. Uh, this step to in uh, to add a sample and example uh, to my SQL Server. Uh, this is an example database for you to select some simple query and just want to learn or research my SQL. Okay, click execute. Okay, we are finished. So, click next. Finish. Here, my we we have installed my my SQL Workbench. So we are we have my SQL work pen. Okay. Um, if you are the first uh, install it, you will do uh, will see some uh, like that. Okay. Now, if you don't, if you don't want to create connection manually, you click scan to. Okay. Here we are. We have a an server here. Provide uh, password for root user. Okay. Here we have an example database here. Okay. It works. Okay. Um, we'll queue a simple query for you. Select. Here we are. Okay. So, um, so thank you for watching this uh video. Uh and I hope you uh give me any uh and me any suggestion and feedback on your my, on my blog or uh, YouTube channel. Thank you for watching again.